I just bathed Burberry this morning because when Ann arrives today, I'm having her convert little Miss Burberry from this teddy bear style into a little schnauzer cut. And you might say, why Burberry looks so cute like that? She does, but I have a suspicion that given her coloring, she's also going to look adorable in a little schnauzer cut. But here's what she looked like this morning after her bath. Look at all this long chocolatey colored coat. Oh my goodness, you are so cute. You can really see the differences here between chocolate and black when I put Burberry and Dazzle together. Yes, hi Dazzle. Good morning. Dazzle is such a beautiful little solid black schnauzer puppy. Yes, you are. Burberry! Hi, Burberry! Oh my goodness, yes, you are a cute. Oh my goodness, look how ex uh, just oh, so cute. Burberry loves Anne. Everybody here loves Anne, but Burberry is definitely expressing her <laughs> affection to Anne right now. And uh, what Burberry probably doesn't understand is that Anne is about to change Burberry's look in a big way. From this. So I gave her a really good bath this morning before Anne got here. Now, Anne normally does the ba bathing for puppies, but given a bunch of things we have going on at the moment, I thought I would help out. So she's had a bath. And she's ready for Anne. Anne has decided she is starting with feet. So she's trimming out the paws. Yes! Good girl, Burberry. And Anne will do this on all four paws. Burberry is being very good as Anne is holding her this way. Notice the way in which Anne is holding Burberry. This helps immensely to be able to do pad and foot work, like cutting toenails and trimming out the hair in between the pads of the feet. So just encouraging you to take note of how Anne is holding Burberry. Burberry's quite fine because she's been used to being held this way. But for those of you who want to do grooming yourself, you'll want to get familiar with and comfortable with showing your puppy how to be held like this. Oh, yeah. And making lots of times for hug and kisses oh, in between the oh, work is positive. also helpful too. Positive reinforcement. <laughs> <laughs> she's loving all the kisses. Burberry is watching herself in the mirror as she is getting her sanitary clip hair. <laughs> Very funny. And I make sure that I do this area on puppies from the time they're about three weeks old on because I like them to be very comfortable with having this done. And you can see Burberry is standing very easily for this. <laughs> so grooming always starts with a bath and a good brush out. And I brushed her before I bathed her. And of course, we'll be brushing her multiple times during the grooming. Anne is a professional groomer. Anne has been grooming for many years and she has a lot of experience with puppies. I'm just showing you how Anne handles the very first time. This is the very first schnauzer groom that this little girl is experiencing. Now she's had the clippers run against her body numerous times, but never the actual blade like this. And what's the blade number that you're using? This is a nine. A nine, all right. It's a very close clip. That's a very good girl. What a good girl, Burberry. You're doing a very nice job. So, Anne, I was just thinking about how grateful I am for you and all of your expertise. You have such deep knowledge about how to work with puppies, adults, all of it. I've been doing it such a long time, and you know 
You know how much I love my job. You know, it's a labor of love for you, just like it's a labor of love for me. And I know that that makes all the difference in the world, both for the puppy as well as uh, for us, as, as we really sincerely enjoy what we're doing. Yeah, I can't think of anything that I have ever loved more in my careers than working with animals, cats and dogs alike. Well, you do such a great job, Ian. Thank you. Yes. And lots of time for hugs oh, and kisses yes. as we're going oh, along. Rub true. Oh my goodness. Yes. Yes. Oh, good girl. Yes. Just shaping the brow. Just tidying up the lines. Anne is going over everything again, just as a way to ensure that the lines are smooth. And now the scissor work begins. So Anne has done everything with the clipper that she was intending to do. And so let's see what happens with the scissors. Amy Lee, the Go Groomer, introduced us to this brand, Kinchi, of scissors. And I have to tell you, it has made all the difference in the world in grooming for me. Of course, Anne knew about great scissors before she ever came to, um, you know, here. But these kind of scissors, oh wow, what a difference. Is look at you. Look at you. Oh, you're a schnauzer. Anne goes around the ear leather with the scissors to make it look really nice. And this is part of the reason why when someone's getting a puppy from me, I do ask them, do you want your puppy in a schnauzer cut or in a teddy bear cut? And if somebody wants it in a schnauzer cut, then I have to make plans for Anne to be able to do the grooming. I can do the teddy bear cut myself, but Anne often does it, but I can do that myself and I can show people how to do it. But this one, I prefer to have Anne do because she is so much better with her hands than I am. And what a great job Anne is doing here with Burberry's first ever traditional schnauzer groom. What a cute little toy schnauzer this is. Well done. Oh, she's precious. Here she is, just having finished her groom, still just loving Anne so much. And I have to laugh at how much hair. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Can you believe she had that much hair on her that now uh, enables her to be a little schnauzer puppy? Yes, aren't you, cutie? And now you can see her finished as a little schnauzer girl. What a cutie you are. And of course she's next to our little schnauzers that are groomed like teddy bears. And so of course they look so much bigger than she does now, but she is younger. There we go. Franklin, this little boy right here, is what, a week and a half younger than Burberry. But you can see he's bigger than her. Yes, what a cutie patini you are. Berber is just all full of hugs and kisses. What a sweetie. And you can really see her beautiful green eyes, hopefully right now in this light. She looks fabulous. Thank you, Anne. Franklin here is in the teddy bear cut. And I love that one too. 
So it just depends on the style of the dog and the, the look of the dog and what you want for your own puppy. We're happy to accommodate both the teddy bear style and the traditional style 